<laughs> Everybody, um, we're back. Just drinking our bucked up to kickstart the day, start everything off. That person just drove really slowly right behind Ryan. Lovely people. Never mind. I can wear a But we got bucked up today. Even Ryan's hopping on the bucked up train. And, you know, we're coincidentally wearing the shirt. But I, I just I recommend this so highly. You know, it's I have it every day. Pour it in the bottle. We're also going to be taking some creatine, so we're going to mix it with creatine. But we're about to head to the gym. Don't forget to use code JOHN1. 20% off your entire purchase. You can go get pre-workout for $15, $10, $15 cheaper. Like, why would you not do it? Go do it. Right now. We are back with the cook-off number two breakfast edition, which is pretty much turned into my French toast versus Ryan's French toast. So comment down below who you think is going to win. The first cook-off we did, I took the W, and it got pretty good reviews by you guys, and you guys liked the cook-off. So we said, why not come back with the second one and make breakfast? So let's get into it. So what I'm trying to make it's like a little fruity type. Like, you know the strawberry banana crepes at IHOP? Going for that take, but with like French toast. So, you got strawberries, banana, whipped cream. Don't have any of the like vanilla icing, but we're gonna make it do. So what I'm going for is, I don't know if any of you know who Greg Doucette is, but he's got this thing called anabolic French toast, which is like healthy French toast. We got some brioche cinnamon raisin bread, which Granted, it isn't the healthiest bread in the world, but it tastes sensational. So I went with egg whites, cinnamon, and um, what is it, vanilla extract. And so when you combine all those, it's basically no fat, minimal sugar, super high protein, super high carb, perfect pre-workout. It's gonna be crap. Just, just wait, just wait. Yes, I'm in designer. If I see her, then I got a bro. Yes, I am a dog with these diamonds on my collar. And that's why I got your girl head banging, so they calling me Nirvana. No, I'm not her daddy, but she calling me her papa. Tell me, is you down, girl? I swear I treat you right. When I see them, it's on sight. Uh, even in the summer, dawn, my neck be frozen ice. Uh, I swear I go hard. Bet you I'll get that. Dog, I got no heart. Bro, like a Kit Kat. I've been up all night, but I wake up for my work, though. My girl looks so good when she draped out in that fur coat Like, yes, I'm in designer If I see her, then I got a bro Yes, I am a dog with these diamonds on my collar And that's why I got your girl head banging So they calling me Touchdown when I land Dog, I need that bad to go I just need a check I need a couple grand for that show I don't got no time to waste I ain't ever moving slow They ain't doing nothing But somehow they do the most uh, They want my soul, dog So I can't sign no deal Bruh, the literal nog of the egg is on this piece of French toast. The what? The nog. The yolk? The <laughs> fuck <laughs> is the nog? <laughs> I ain't whisk it up well enough. Oh, that is money. All right, so it has been assembled. The bananas, strawberry, and the whipped cream. You know? Not a very good baker, but it looks kind of good. You cannot lie. So, once we try it, give you a little review, see how it came out. All right, so my French toast, sadly, it does not look as appetizing as Ryan's. Mine is the healthier version. Yes, this has fruit, but this is anabolic French toast. It was made with egg whites instead of whole eggs. We got some cinnamon powder in there, some vanilla extract, and the bread is um, like raisin cinnamon brioche breads on it. There's a couple of grams of sugar in the bread, but really not that much. 
This is healthy. All right. See what John's tastes like. It's actually good. You taste the cinnamon, definitely. And it's like, even without syrup, it's like not dry. It's moist. I thought it'd be like super dry. Taste, I give it like a eight out of ten. It's pretty good. All right, it's my turn to try Ryan's. I'm not gonna lie, this looks insanely good. This looks absolutely sensational. And so, uh, we'll see what happens. I'll try and get a little bit of everything here. Banana, strawberry, and whipped cream. Here we go. I'm not gonna lie, that's sensational. That's very good. Even just the bread, like, even just the French toast is good. Not even just of fruit and whipped cream. Solid French toast. I'd give it at least an eight, maybe even a nine. That, that's good. pretty good actually. The French toast aspect of it, for me personally, mine was better. Like the toast, the, the actual bread part for me was better than his. But due to the fact that he has fruit and whipped cream on top, his tasted better. It was sensational. I'd probably give mine an eight and I'd probably give his a nine. I'd, I'd probably give Brian the edge on this one. Take one of the pieces that you got. Make sure you get like whipped cream and everything. Yeah. Strawberry, banana. Oh, all right. His like toast definitely tastes better. I think just because like the fact that I have whipped cream and strawberries and banana. I think mine tastes a little bit better. His is like an eight, I give mine a nine. All right guys, so there you have it. The cook-off number two, breakfast edition, AKA John's Anabolic French Toast versus Ryan's Fruit Sugar Sensation French Toast is now complete. Ryan took the double on that one. I'm not gonna lie, his French Toast did taste better than mine, but you know, we'll take the L, we'll bounce back and we'll move forward. Um, let us know what you guys want to see next week, and that will be it. We will see you guys next week. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Peace.